Hello everybody, this is Napa Fan here, and this is the 14th race in season number one of the Crown Royal Series. We are here at the Michigan International Speedway for the Ford Mustang 250. Uh, an 18 lap race here today, and it should be a good one. Uh, as always on these super speedways, this is actually the first race I've ever done on Nap or on Napa Fan once the channel, uh, since this channel has been called Napa Fan, uh, and it uh, it's good to be back because this is definitely a great track. I don't know why I didn't use it in season one of the Cup Series, but I don't know. But anyway, um, Trey Barto starts on the pole. Christian Master alongside him, Matt Dalio, Dale Salzman, Eric Hyden, Adam Pinchon, Jacob Reed. Uh, Aaron Walpole, Cameron Gaiju, Will Blake, man. In all honesty, I mean, I don't really want to say I don't want him to do good, but I know he isn't watching, and I know I just kind of feel that the fact that he's doing so good is hurting uh, these, and uh, the higher he is, the more points he gets. And I, I mean, I kind of, I would hate it if somebody that isn't watching wins the championship, but uh, you know, it is what it is. I mean, he's still a great friend of mine, but. I'm not doing reserves anymore. <laughs> anyway, Tristan Walker, Cameron Garlington, Biff Crafton, Dana Mon, Richard Schaffner, Diego Stevenson, Joffrey Toussaint, Ferdinand Gabot, Max Newerf, Mason Towers, Tyler Selson, Marshall Free, Elijah Gordon, Alan Cavignaro, Eric Gallmanhart, Warren Henniger, Dean Wickard, Eric Powers, Harry Del Arvin, Alonzo, Caleb Hoffman, Nicholas Samadio, Kevin Gandar, Jonathan Skim, Nikki Stewart, Grattan L, Jay Mills Day, John Weeks, Garrett Sinor, Cliff Buchanan, Austin Spencer, Riley White. Let's get this one started before you guys stop watching. having any problems. Of course, TV2 is usually a pretty lousy camera, so I'm not going to use that one. Uh, so, yeah. 18 laps here in the Ford Mustang 250 at Michigan. It's been a long time. I, it's been like 10 months since I've ever done a race here, and uh, probably 10 months since I've ever opened the track. But uh, we'll see how these guys handle it. I have, I, I swear, I've not, I've done no, no testing at all. So we might, might end up with a crash fest here in this one. Uh, but if we do, that's what it'll be. Here we go. Trey Barto leads us off here at Michigan. Already have some three wide back in here. Trey Bartow out front, the one of Matt Dalio in second place. Here comes Dale Salzman in the 43. Got Master on the high lane, Adam Pinchon in here as well. It's still Trey Bartow. We'll see how the TV2 cam works. TV2 might be similar to the uh, Texas World Cam. Possibly. That looks a lot more like Texas World there. Hopefully we don't have any. Yeah, okay, never mind. I don't like those still frames. Anyway, we have really fast speeds here. And they go 3, 4, Y. We should see a lot of passing in this race. Here comes Salzman on the back bumper of Barto, trying to take the lead on the second lap. And Will Blake just can't stop him. He's in third right now in that number 39, trying to take the points lead. He's going underneath of Barto for second is Salzman. Leads uh, this lap. And here comes Blake. You know, it's kind of ironic. He really has not led that many laps in any of the races before. Um, and he's never won a race. But he is one of the most consistent drivers I've ever seen on this channel. And uh, he's doing a fantastic job. Okay, I'm sorry I keep on doing that. But anyway, Salzman out front in the 43. Will Blake could not get by him. On the inside, here comes Tristan Walker in the 44 and Dana Mon in the 40. And our, the guy is in last place in points right now. Richard Schaffner is up here. And it's kind of hard to believe. He actually does have a win this season, but he's in last place. That's uh, kind of hard to believe. But uh, he's trying to change all of that around here today. Now he still has some time to catch up. It's, you know, we're not done the season yet. We may be over halfway, but we still have 11 races left. Uh, actually, sorry, we have 10 races left after this one. So, 
Anything's possible. What happened to Delio? Man, you, when you get stuck on the high lane, you you fall back. Dalio all the way back in, uh, let's see, where is that? 19th, so, uh, that isn't really too good. But anyway, Will Blake's kind of be, kind of got uh, put back here in that 39 on the high lane there. And uh, the 43 of Dale Salzman is still out front in this uh, Ford Mustang. Uh -huh. This is what the race name is, Ford Mustang 250. And when we come to Michigan, nobody really wants to see the Toyotas win except for Alan Cavignaro and maybe Tristan Walker because he drives a Toyota and uh, is right now running second. We got Aaron Walpole here uh, in third, Richard Schaffner, Marshall Free, Christian Master, Will Blake stuck in the high lane. Uh, Alan Cavignaro is up here. Got Eric Hyden, uh, Cameron Garlington. Our points leader, Eric Almanhart. If he can pass Will Blake, uh, he will stay in the points lead if he can finish in front of him. But the points battle is really between two guys uh, that did not sign up for their cars. Eric Almanhart didn't sign up, but I, know, I do know he's watching. Uh, so con congratulations to you for following in. And Will Blake uh, got a reserve when he didn't really need to get one. <laughs> yeah, I'm sorry about that. Anyway, they've gotten by the 43, and now Richard Schaffner is trying to take the lead, and here comes Almanhart in the 29, our points leader, has gotten by Will Blake, and that's good for the points lead, uh, that's good for Eric Almanhart when it comes to the championship. We got guys moving up here. Uh, that's uh, Christian Master in the 9. He won at Armory Digital. And Alan Cavignaro is yet to win a Crown Royal Series race. Uh, all he would need to do is win a race here in the Crown Royal Series and a race in the trucks. And he would be the winner of the Quadruple Crown. We still haven't gotten that yet. Matter of fact, of all the Quadruple Crown participants, uh, the highest is only two series that a driver has won. We've had some three-time three series three, three series uh, three series winners. Uh, but they are not uh, quadruple crown participants. Uh, a lot of those guys who have three wins have them in the Cup, the uh, Crown Royal Series, and the Truck Series, and they were not in the Hers Elimination Series. Cavignaro got a win in the Hers Elimination Series and a win in the uh, Cup Series earlier, and now trying to get a win here today at Michigan, but he's going to get stuck on the high lane. And next time we cross the line, we'll be halfway through this race, and Christian Nasser just... Wow, he just pulled away there from the rest of the pack as they were going like three wide. Now Eric Hyden trying to get up to him, and Cavi Naro with a run on the high lane. But will he be able to hold off the 29? Yeah, he's going to uh, dip down low, and Cavi Naro is still in this in that number uh, 34 or 54. Why is this saying that he's in. Okay, just didn't update, I guess. Aaron Walpole in the 84, now underneath of Almond Hart. The inside lane working right now. And these guys better be careful. Now, we haven't really seen any signs of them possibly crashing, but it is still possible. And, and Hyden, you know, this shows that you do not want to be that far ahead because the draft is a really big factor here at Michigan. Calvin Nero getting second from Master in the 54. But Eric Hyden is leading in this 28. If I'm not mistaken, he's trying to get his first career win on Napa Fan. I'm not sure if Salzman has one. I don't think he has. So he's trying to get his first career win as well. Um, but the next guy who was never won is Joffrey Toussaint. And he's been in a lot of races and uh, yet to win. Uh, but other than that, we got uh, Matt Dalio who hasn't won. Will Blake hasn't won. Day John Weeks has never won. Um, Marshall Free has never won. Jonathan Skivnicki has never won. I think it's about seven. I don't know. I'm not really formally counting. And Buchanan, Dean Wickard, uh, Schaffner, Reed, Spencer, Alonzo, Hanniger, pa Mason Powers has never won. Um, that might be it. Kevin Gandara has never won. So we only have like about 10 guys in this race that has never won a Navi fan. And that's how fast it is closing up. And uh, Kevin Gandara got by Hyden for the lead. 
Yeah, well, Paul, how about Salzman in this 18? Uh, Cavignaro's teammate. Cavignaro trying to stay out front in the number 54 and get his first career Crown Royal Series win and his third career Napa fan win here today. Masterson trying to get his second career Napa fan win and his second career uh, Crown Royal Series race uh, here today as well. Uh, well, yeah, I don't know. Now they're mainly going single file out front, but don't expect it to stay that way for long. Uh, we got guys like Allman Hart and Gaju. You know, they're trying to work and make it happen. It's possible that anyone in this top ten can still win this race. But Cavignaro has found a way to keep second place behind him. And, uh... He's able to kind of use, like, a middle lane and get the run... And he's able to hold these guys off pretty well. Here comes Master, though, trying to change that up a little bit. He might get a run down the front stretch, but Cavignaro is still leading with four laps to go here at Michigan. But he's not going to be able to keep that lead. Here comes Master in the nine underneath of them for first place. And I don't think Cavignaro is going to be able to hold the outside. Eric Hyden still in this. Aaron Walpole still in this. Salzman and Pinchon not too far behind, but uh, these guys are racing side by side, and the more side by side you go, the slower you get. It's still anybody's race. Christian Masters still out front in the number nine. And now with three laps to go, we'll see if he can pull it off. Master trying to win his second career Crown Royal Series race. I'm pretty sure he's still high up in the points, so a win here would definitely help his point standings. Here comes Hyden underneath of Cavignaro for second with help from Walpole, and uh, Master is pulling away a little bit, and that's not a good thing. When you pull away like that, those cars behind you get a really good draft on you, and uh, they can close up fast. Walpole trying to help Hyden on the inside. He wants to get up there and battle for the win. Trying to get his first career Crown Royal Series win, but where did he come from? Out of Pinchon. Looking for third. Trying to get his second career Crown Royal Series win as well. He's uh, won the race at Dover earlier. And Hyden. And now we have uh, one and a half laps to go. And Eric Hyden now trying to take the lead from Christian Master. But these guys behind them might get the run here on the final lap. We'll see. Christian Master is still out front, but will he be leading the next time around? We'll see. White flag is out here at Michigan. There goes Hyden for the lead. Eric Hyden trying to win his first career Napa fan race. Can he do it? Walpole has a run in this 84, I think. Oh, yeah, he does. Aaron Walpole trying to close up, but can he do it? Eric Hyden takes it from Christian Master on the final lap, but here we go, side by side at the line. 84 of Aaron Walpole trying to do it, and it's, uh, it's Hyden. Eric Hyden barely did that. And when I say barely did that, I mean barely did that. And Eric Hyden gets his first career Napa fan win. How about Walpole? He had that draft. If the finish line was just a few inches farther, Walpole would have won that thing. But Hyden was able to hold him off and get his first career Napa fan win here today. Three one thousandths of a second. That was close. But it was uh, really good there. Rusty, we'll go ahead and replay it. It was close enough for a replay. And, uh, right, okay, right there, that's about as close as we're going to get to it, right there, and Eric Hyden pulls it off in the number 28, how about that, great job by Eric Hyden getting his first career win, Aaron Walpole, Dale Salzman, Christian Master, and Joffrey Toussaint, the top five, take a look at the rest of the results right here, nobody was out of the race, I like it when we see that. And every driver finished, but Biff Crafton finished in last place. 
Somebody's got to finish in last place. Even if you don't crash, you still have to have someone finish in last place. But anyway, congratulations to Eric Guyton on his win here in the Ford Mustang 250. Next race is going to be at Nashville. That should be a good one here in the Crown Royal Series. And yeah, here are the points for the Crown Royal Series. Thank you guys very much for watching, and I will see you guys later.